Well, let's do some. I wish I could give you a date on this one, but I just can't. I'm really sorry, but my hands are tired. It's not that I'm holding information from you. I just don't know. God is not speaking. The information is confidential. He concealed the day until the appointed time. It's not even on a need-to-know basis. I mean, you would think that the church would need to know, right? I mean, God has us preparing and declaring that Jesus is coming again, but no mention of when it's going to happen. Or what about the angels that are ushering Jesus in? No, they don't know either. Not even Jesus knows, and he's the main event. Talk about confidential. The day is kept secret for means of revelation, for the mystery of God will be revealed. And no one will be able to debate what every eye shall behold. When he comes, it will take the whole world by surprise, like a thief in the night. For those who are eagerly awaiting his arrival, it will be salvation and eternal life. Look, I'm not a dead servant, but this is a warning to be prepared. Let us not suppose that he is delaying or think that he is not coming at all. Let us not become busy with life and weighed down by this world. Let us be awake and have nothing to hide. Make his coming your blessed hope. This is Reverend David Allen with just a glimpse saying be blessed, be blessed, and be blessed.